So four sets for chest and back and quads and shoulders. On smaller body parts, so biceps and triceps, I do three exercises, two sets. Wow. Yeah. And that's remarkable. The physique you built in today's world of the volume getting pushed in the social media, like volume, 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 you built a remarkable physique doing much less than what the recommendations are today, the generalized recommendations, you know? So I think or, that's really cool. Or mm. the people today make remarkable gains, wasting so much time in the gym. I mean, that's just my slightly no, it's, old, it's school, slightly bro science, slightly tongue in cheek, and it's meant to be a little bit. But if you do 15 reps, what are the first five doing, in my opinion? Oh, interesting. So even with the, in terms of the rep range, because you, that's right, you mentioned you did. So was that four to six reps per exercise? That was for every single exercise? Yeah, I might, might get up to eight sometimes, but I never used to get to 10. And that's the same for biceps and triceps, like even lateral raise, like shoulders, same thing? You know, there's some movements that there's an exception, but okay, this isn't one of those, it's an exception and it's on everything. So exceptions, calves, I would sometimes go more reps, but only some, some people go, oh, you know, cal yeah, calves have to be with more because they're so strong and they have to be more reps. Well, no, no. I think if you find the right machine so that you can put the weight on without squashing yourself, I would still be trying to put enough weight on a normally a leg press, toe press thing so that I could basically lift it up six, seven, eight times with my calves that said we would sometimes do i say we because not the royal we there's a lot of this on social media they talk about yeah. we but we just mean you when i say we i'm talking about when i was competing and i had a training partner i've had about five training partners in my entire life so they tend to last yeah so we me and my training partner would also do stuff like 15 10 5 on calves so we do 15 reps which was absolutely to failure drop a bit of weight do another 10 drop a bit of weight and one of my training partners gareth was like this isn't 15 10 5 we're just doing a set of 30 i'm like hmm. well if you want to see it like that we see it like that <laughs> and that was something that we found useful for calves but also really heavy so on the whole yes you're entirely right in how you play it back four to eight reps maximum on basically everything with on basic. occasional stuff like that, occasional 21s, occasional drop sets. On average, for most things, it was four to eight, we'll say. Yeah. And preferably four to six for you, right? Yeah. So so with respect to your training routine back then, you trained four days a week when you were preparing for contest. What did that look like? Was it like an upper lower? How did the, what was the split like back then? Or did it always change? I don't know, split is just, split is the same as it is today perhaps the order changes occasionally but basically i do 